Okay, so moving down, we are gonna need a logo. Let's go ahead and make a custom logo for our site, even though it's kind of cool they gave us this Alder logo. To add a logo, I always like starting at logomaker.com. That's L-O-G-O-M-A-K-R without the E.com. All right, once you're here, we can click away from the video. And first, we just want to search from a graphic. So I really want the blog to be a travel blog. And for that reason, I'm going to go ahead and search for a jet or an airplane, that sort of thing. All right, cool. And you get really more examples of icons than you could ever want. All right, so once you search for a little bit at all your icons, and you could search something else, like really any keyword you can think of, then you're going to settle on an icon. And I really like this one up top because it just makes me think of a nice, cool private jet just floating through the sky, taking you wherever you want to go. So we're going to grab it, and it'll come into our panel here. And we can see it's really easy to just click and drag and move it. All right, you can also click on the corners and make it bigger. And they have these helpful aligning lines. Looking good. Now we just need some text. So let's click on that T. And I'm going to start typing something. Well, that something is going to be bluehostsetup.com because that's the name of our domain name. And in most cases, I think the title of your site should match your domain name. Plus, it describes what we're doing here. We're setting up an awesome blog at Bluehost, the best web hosting. Okay, so here we go with our text. We're going to position it next to our icon, but not too close. Obviously, we don't want any overlap unless it happens to look good that way. Which it could really, I guess it could, maybe it does. To change the font, we can go up to the drop down for simple and modern and change it to something cool like handwriting. And then you're going to get more drop down options on the right. So go ahead and play around to your heart's content. Don't go too crazy here. After all, your logo should be clear and easy for your readers to process. All right, so I really like Happy Monkey. I think that's just the right amount of style for me right now. I'm gonna make it a little bigger. And then what I'm gonna do is change the color of the text and the icon. To do that, you just wanna have one of them selected, like right now we're selecting the text. Now click on your color wheel and it will change to match wherever you point and click. We can check out our site to see what kind of colors are prominent right now. So it's going to be kind of tans, lighter grays, blacks, maybe even like a pink. So let's go with that direction here. Let's just to make it easy on ourselves. I'm going to try to go with like a nice orangish pink color. And then you can do the same thing for the icon itself. We can click on our airplane icon and we can change that to maybe a slightly darker version of what we just chose. And bear with me if it looks crazy at first. I I think our vision will hold true once we get it done right. All right, almost there, guys. And one rule of thumb is to definitely have the first text, uh, first letters of your logo be clear. So we don't want that B cut off or something weird like that. We want it to be super clear, the first letter of your text. All right, and we nailed it. So you might want to add more icons. Of course, you can do that. You can go as crazy as you want. There are so many different options. Once you have your logo looking perfect, all you need to do is just crop it on the lower right to get rid of that unnecessary white space. So this looks good. We'll bring in a little more. White space is always just going to be a pain in the butt in WordPress, so get rid of it. And now hit enter to confirm the crop, and we're going to click the save floppy disk icon to save it. All right, now we're going to say no thanks and name our logo. So logo version one sounds good and save it. And there are instructions here for giving credit to Logo Maker, so please make sure to follow these steps and add credit once you're done uploading your logo. Where it says note credit is required, just click follow this guide. And we can scroll down and say that for a website, what you need to do is copy and paste some text like this, and then make a credits page, and then link that to Logo Maker URL. So back in WordPress, I know it's an additional step, but you should have this page always going forward is hover on new and click page, call it credits, then come down and we're going to paste that text. Beautiful. And then we're going to link that to logo maker. So the way you add a link is just by first getting the link. So we're going to get the link to logomaker.com, which is just logomaker.com. Copy that. Now in WordPress, we're just going to highlight this whole piece of text click on the link icon to add a link and then paste your URL. 
Click the gear to make this open in a new tab and click update and publish that credits page. Awesome, great job. And make sure the credits page is displayed somewhere prominently just like they request you to do so. Okay, now to upload our logo, we're gonna go back to WordPress and hover on appearance and click customize where we're spending a lot of our time here. And now we're gonna go to header and logo settings and click select image under upload logo. Now select files and WordPress will search your computer where you're doing your work from and it should find logo version one. Just click open, all right, and click choose image. And hopefully it works and it did. Awesome, great job guys. So we now have our own custom logo. Of course you can add any icons you want. I just kind of like it because there's an airplane and it also symbolizes like launching something or starting a new journey, which you might be doing today with your new blog at Bluehost. And by the way, I'm sure you guys can make a way better logo than this. All right, let's publish. X out and check out the homepage and see what we made. Great job, we're really cruising now.